Chief Meteorologist Mike Nelson joins us now. And Mike, Nicholas is lingering around Louisiana. It is. We could sure borrow some of that moisture. 18 inches of rain that they get in one night is more than the Denver area typically gets in an entire year. And we're one of the wetter parts of Colorado. You compare the San Luis Valley, Southeast Plains, and they don't see nearly that kind of precipitation. We have a little bit around here now. It doesn't amount to a whole lot. There are some stronger storms to the southeast of us where there is a severe thunderstorm. Watch Elbert County all the way down to Baca County. So around the Denver area, Fort Collins, Greeley, Boulder, just a few storms, not many. They'll be ending. Temperatures will be cooling off about 60 by 11 p.m. And today certainly was a pleasant one at 80. 51 was our low this morning. 92 the record. 2018, 29 back in 2003. 81 and 51 of the averages. So this is what it should feel like this time in mid-September. Currently 78 at the airport, 71 downtown. Barometer falling slightly south, southeast winds, good air quality. Tonight, skies are going to clear. Lows are going to be cool. Lower 50s, Denver, Fort Collins, Greeley. It'll be 34 at Leadville, 36 at Gunnison. Front range numbers, 33, Kremlin and Walden. Otherwise, mainly 40s in the mountains, low 50s on the plains. Tomorrow starts out as a very comfortable day. Now, I earlier showed you that cold front that had slipped in. It's going to reverse field as a warm front tomorrow. So we start sunny and comfortable. But as that front crosses the area by midday, warmer conditions coming in. And it'll be hot and dry by late in the day. The highs tomorrow climbing back up into the low 90s. Many locations across eastern Colorado and out west. 70s and 80s in the mountains. Durango about 85 degrees. Front range numbers 70s in the mountains near 90. Again on the plains. That front continues to push toward the north and east away from us. We're hot Thursday, slightly cooler Friday and Saturday. I'm watching a little stronger system early next week that could drop the temperatures considerably by Monday and Tuesday. For tonight, a few storms early, clearing in 52. Tomorrow, the high temperature at 90 degrees. And looking ahead, we'll see those temperatures in the 90s again Thursday, 93. 87 Friday, 88 coming up on Saturday. Sunday will be 85 degrees. And then Monday and Tuesday, if the system comes in, should be showers and cooler. Highs only in the 70s, mid-40s for lows by early Tuesday morning.